This must be Pitchcliff. Murad's agent should be at the marketplace by now. Sign of Marat's guy. He's had plenty of time to investigate. We'd better look for him. Damn right. Someone left here recently, and they were in a hurry. Has to be Murad's guy. Durval's thugs must have made him. Maybe because he found something. Look at this. I think he drew a map with his own blood. Right. Those kind of maps you know you better follow. That might be Pitchcliff. He marked a spot to the north. Could be Durval's location. And my men are waiting outside of town. I'll grab them and meet you there. Looks like they've been chained up. Durval's a tinker. He probably experiments on them or, or strips them for parts. Maybe I can use them to make some trouble. I'll go in first. Hold off until the fighting starts. All right. We've got your back.
do. Nerva says you gotta eat dirt! Ursa must be in there. We have to get through. They must use these to protect themselves from that awful sound. Aaron? Durval tried to break me. Shows what he knows. I, sh I should have been with you. Why didn't you come for me? I, I know I'm a useless trunk, but... No, idiot. I got a message from Durval saying he wanted to parlay. I didn't come for you because I knew it was a trap. I couldn't let you get hurt. Just didn't think it'd be that good a trap. Thought I could take him out. <laughs> no. Now listen. Durval's planning something big in Meridian. He said he'd 
force Avad to watch as the smoke darkens their precious sun. Your king needs you. No more playing around. You're gonna have to grow up fast. I, I will. I promise. Be you damn well better, little brother. Ursa. No, no. Please. I won't let you down. I promise. Erend, I'm... I'm so sorry. You've got to find Durval. But Meridian's a big place. I'll... Uh, I'll look through his things. Maybe we can narrow it down. Just notes about crafting. And a letter tucked between the pages. Lots of blaze. Headed to Meridian. If we find it, I'll bet we find Durval too. This machine's been picked apart with precision. What's Durval learned from all his tinkering? Do I even want to know? I think I found something that can help. Let's head back to the palace. Go. I won't be long, but I need to tend to my sister. I've sent a messenger to the claim to let everyone know. If there's anything you or your clan need for her arrangements, you need but ask. There'll be time for all of that later. Aloy, I'm glad you're back. I'm at a loss about Ursa. To learn she lives, then lose that hope seems cruel. She wouldn't want us to waste time talking. She'd want us to find Durval. She said he'd raved about smoke darkening the sun. Tell him what you found in his papers. A letter. It mentioned a shipment of Blaze being sent to a warehouse here. Only, it wasn't addressed to Duval. The name was Ayland Forgeman. Does that mean anything to you? Uh, sounds familiar. Yes, a landlord. The Osaram have been buying up buildings across the city, including one under that name. Let me think. It's by the edge of the mesa, near the temple. It used to be a shop, but it could serve as a warehouse. If Durval used the name as an alias to buy it, he might even be there now. I'll round up my men. I'll meet you there. Erend, wait. Remember that no one hates Durval more than your own tribe. The clans would give up much to obtain him. Take him alive? So you can haggle over him? You can't be serious! Our security depends on keeping the peace. If the opportunity presents itself, take him alive. Consider that a command. 
Aloy, a moment, please. When we spoke, Aaron didn't wish to dwell on the details of Ursa's death. Understandable, of course. But now that they've been left to my imagination, those details are all I can think about. You were there. Did she suffer? She's not the one who's suffering now. You are. She died before you could say goodbye. Is it that obvious? You're right. I'm dwelling on my pain, not just hers. And there's only one thing left that can help. Find Durval and bring him before me. He will answer for his crimes. Don't let your guard down. Adventurers, preferably with no friends or family, but I'm not choosing. This is the place. You home, Durval? I got a surprise for you. For us. Is it a bomb? It's a bomb, all right. Doesn't look too big. Big enough to kill us. All right. I'll shut up. Blaze. It must be leaking from something upstairs. That's a lot of blaze. If that bomb downstairs goes off. It'll be just what Durval promised. Smoke will darken the sun as the city goes up in flames. There's, there's gotta be a way to stop it. If I try to take it apart, a booby trap will set it off. If we can get rid of it somehow, the blast will be much smaller. If we can get rid of it somehow, the blast will be much smaller. Maybe there's some way I can open this window. It looks like a wooden bracket. Not very strong. Help me push this out. Okay. Brute force. I'm good at that. What'll it do? Save the city, I hope. But when the blaze falls, run for it, because the booby trap on the bomb downstairs is going to get set off. Uh, will we survive? Probably not. Now push. Uh. Best shot, and Meridian's still standing. This is over. Durval said he'd make a Vod watch. No way. To do that, he'd have to get into the palace. And that's too heavily guarded. Get back there, just to be sure. I'm gonna look around. Maybe Durval's men left something behind when they planted that bomb. I got it. Don't worry. He tries for the palace. He's finished.
Boot tracks. With just a bit of blaze in them. Can I interest you in a reasonable share? Get to the fire and set up a bucket line! What happened? She did it. I haven't had a blast like that since the liberation. Could you spare a moment to speak to the fire things? There's smoke rising from the edge of the mesa. Are we under attack? The tracks lead inside. Another one of Durval's hideouts. Must be where Derval assembled the detonator. <sighs> he tunneled through the wall. Derval did find a way into the palace. I wish I could be there to see the sun god on his knees. Quit, Carpenter. you. Gonna need this. Look at you, Avad. The wriggling runt of a maniac king. You robbed me of my right to kill your father, so I'll have to settle for you. I'm going to enjoy watching the Karja burn, even more because you'll be watching with me. Say goodbye to Meridian, Avad. Breathe in the stench and choke on the ashes. Something's wrong. Didn't? I, I didn't hear anything! There's a bit of smoke rising from the mesa's edge. No! It should be a firestorm, not some belt from a charcoal burner! What's this? Oh. You must be the Nora who bushwhacked my camp. And disabled your bomb. Did you now? Well, bomb or no bomb, I'm gonna splatter that throne with blood. First yours, then Avad's. I see something. Why does Avar always have his lady?
I've led an army. Killed pestilence and ravagers. A savage is nothing. This isn't over yet. Good Osaran Tinker will tell you. Always have a third plan. Saw me. Here we go. You can get a machine to do it for you! Murderous Flint Hawks! Never do the work if you can get a machine to do it for you! Ah! Those majestic, murderous Flint Hawks! Join back. There's more in the way! As much as I wish Ursa was here to kill you, I don't mind doing it for her. Go ahead. I'm not afraid. Except that knowing you, Erend, you'll screw it up! A 
I know what you are afraid of. Going back to Mainspring in chains. Every clan in the claim wants you dead. And they know how to make it hurt. They'll even bid for the privilege. It's just like you to get someone else to do your killing. Shut up. You're at the Sun King's mercy now. Let's have a chat. No, a colorful discussion. That must be the spire. It's huge. A woman now leads the hunters. Come to gloat, Nora. Well, as you can see, busy. I get it. You want to rub it in? Well, it's not working. a moment to speak of the father things. Aloy. I was just thinking about Ursa. She would have killed Durval on the spot. I know it. That's why she went out to meet him in the first place, to put him down. But she also told me to grow up. I gotta admit it burned a little when she said that, but I'm trying to take it to heart. And I guess growing up means putting what you should do in front of what you want to do. Right? <laughs> You're asking me? I'm pretty sure you're older. Yeah, but I don't act like it, do I? You did with Durval. Yeah, don't give me too much credit. Part of me still wants to wait for a quiet moment and wring his neck. Yeah, but you won't. Because you're a good captain. Come on, stop. So, after all this, what's next for errand vanguardsmen? Uh, heading back to the claim for a while. I'll get in touch with my clan and we'll lay Ursa to rest properly. Like how she would have wanted. And by that I mean less chit chat, more drinking. What do you think the Osirim will do to Durval? First off, they'll argue about it for a long time. But whatever they come up with, it won't be quick. I can live with that. In fact, I might just drop by his cell under the sun ring to remind him what's coming. Well. I know, you gotta go. Killers to track, machines to master, all before breakfast. You know what? When we met, I thought I was a big shot talking to a pretty girl hidden away in the middle of nowhere. And now I see that I was just lucky to get a minute of your time. Try not to forget about me while you're out there changing the world. I'll always have a minute for you. Maybe even two. Two? Huh. She likes me.
Aloy, to say you have my gratitude feels woefully insufficient. You saved my life. You saved Meridian. And because of you, there will be justice for Ursa's murder. We can mourn her knowing the truth without painful uncertainty. It's hard to imagine where we'd be without you. And I don't want to try. I hope you will consider staying in Meridian. Were you and Ursa, you know? I suppose it's obvious how I feel, how I felt about her. But we couldn't be together. Relations between the Karja and Osiram and Meridian were the union of the Sun King and an Osiram warrior would have led to open revolt in the city. And pro Did anyone... Only one. Derval. He wanted her, but she rejected him. What exactly will happen to Derval? For now... He'll languish in one of the old cells under the... As for what happens after we negotiate his expedition to Mainspring, my father was very creative when it came to inflicting suffering. What a waste. Derval is a brilliant man. I wonder what... I know who attacked the Nora. A faction of Shadow Karja called the Eclipse. They're digging up ancient machines, weapons they want to use to strike Meridian. I see. What you're saying echoes whispers I've heard from Marad. A Shadow Karja splinter group. Corrupted machines across the land. When will the attack come, do you know? I'm not sure yet. And we will do what we can to prepare. Keep me informed if you learn more. Shall we talk some more? Why do you want me to stay in Meridian? I would think that would be obvious. Not to me. Huh. Well, to start with, you kept the city from going up in flames. You were strong. I could use. It might be worth taking a moment to examine what you just said. You just lost Ursa, a woman who stood at your side and could easily be described as strong, shrewd, and capable. It's pretty clear how you felt about her. And now you're asking me to take- By the sun, you do indeed share much with Ursa. Including a withering eye for foolishness. Ah. Please, accept my apologies. Seems I'm getting ahead of myself. I will be forever grateful to you, Aloy. And in time, I'd like to get to know you better. Shall we? I have to go. I understand. <laughs>